Hello and welcome to episode 34, series 2 of U Squad Legends. Thank you to everybody who watched the streams fast tracking into the Barclays Premier League. We're here now, it is July the 3rd, 2023. And if you have a look, 8th in the league there, Fleetwood Town. In the mix with all the great teams in England. If you didn't watch the streams live, they are available on YouTube. Episode 31, 32 and 33 are all streams and they're all available for your viewing pleasure. Now let's have a look at our transfer targets for this year. There is only one. It's a striker. He's Polish. He's 19 years old and 75 overall. His name is Pavel Zakharov. He plays for Paris Saint-Germain, but that's not the most interesting thing about him. The most interesting thing about him is that he's a direct regen of Wubu So therefore we have to buy him. Also he's six foot six with a weak foot of four star and five star skill moves. That's pretty sick. Other than the availability of Zakara in the winter window, I am not intending to buy any other player. Um, if we do sell someone for a high price, we can buy someone in for a low price, similar in skill. But I'm not not really intending to buy anyone in particular now. Um, I'm now going to run down a squad report for people who didn't watch the streams to show you who we've bought and who we've got rid of and how we're faring this year. So, in goal we have Simon Kachunga overall of 93 gone up 1. Right back is William Martin, overall 78. Jack Waghorn, overall 79. Pablo Carrera Silva gone up 1, overall of 82. David Guthrie, overall of 77. Jack Atkinson, overall of 85. Diego Lique Conde, overall of 79. Serge Mango, overall of 79. Dominico Piscopo, overall of 93. Stefan Betrovic, overall of 84. Luis Gustavo da Silva Fritas, overall of 80. Sebastian Abero, the player they called Piscopo 2 in the stream, overall of 79, gone of 1. Kepa Miguel, overall of 79. Jonathan Silva, overall of 73. Aaron Craney, overall of 80. Cesar Miguel, overall of 68. Mads Kuss, skinny blad, yeah, yeah, shanky, shanky, overall of 76. Joe Sadler, overall of 79. Rashid Wright Phillips, overall of 66. Paris Logan, overall of 72. Bonds Wagstaff, overall of 71. Francisco Miguel, overall of 72. Max K, overall of 65, gone at 1. Jen Serik Memedy, overall of 63. Tom Tomlin, overall of 73. Jack Von Jacku, overall of 64. Christian Chickson, overall of 69. Julian Ginchek, overall of 72. Adam Fielding, overall of 73, gone at 1. Glenn Forster, overall of 79, gone up 1. Sam Maxted, overall of 79. And finally, Marcus Barboza, the centre-back that we bought from Newcastle, overall of 83. Transfer offer for Pablo Carrera Silva at 13.5 million. His valuation is 15.5. And I would want about 17.5 for that man to move on. Oh God. Barcelona have matched it and gone ahead with the deal for Pablo Carrera Silva. We're going to have to find ourselves a centre-back. If only we could get Mark Halthor. Lucas Souza Santos is already 83 overall at 21 years of age. I'm guessing this is the regen of uh, Thiago Silva. And he's worth 17.5 million. He's 6 foot 6. And got a weak foot of 5 star. I'll just add him to the shortlist and approach to buy him when I have the money. Lucas Souza Santos would be available for £22.5 million. And we will have £22.5 million as soon as the deal for Carrera Silva goes through. 
Play is sold. Carrera Silva is off to FC Barcelona for £17.5 million. The board has allocated £15 million to your current transfer budget. Okay, Lucas Souza Santos approached to buy and it was 22.5. Oh, there we go. Submit it. We've got him. Here we go. You just said that the trap. Oh my god. So now they want 23.5 million offers. Alright then. Fine, I don't care. One million more. It's not like it's breaking the bank. Got a transfer offer for Jack Whitehorn. That's from Stad Rene. 79 overall, 24 year old. Uh, tell you what. Mind you, that is a good offer. God damn it. I'll accept it. I'm sure I can find another centre back of Jack Waghorn's quality for the money available to me now. Transfer offer accepted for Lucas Souza Santos. Now we go to the contract negotiations. He wants £60,000 for four years. I'll make it five, and he's a crucial first team player. Play sold. Jack Waghorn has gone to Stad Rene. That was quick. Lucas Souza Santos is in. That's one centre back in. Right, we have £9 million and a wage budget of £125,000 to get another centre back. It's even better when the best replacement for Waghorn is a free agent. Ruben Inza Bohiguez. His estimated worth is already £5.5 million. He's 70, 75 overall, should I say. He's 19 years old, uh, six foot two, and a weak foot of three stars. Very capable centre back. Let's have a look at his strength. Strength of 91. We'll approach to sign this guy. Put a contract on the table for him. Well, that's a disappointment. Contract offer declined because I don't think you can actually give me the role that you offered. So, if I were to submit another offer, say, about the same as last time, instead of not putting crucial first team player, I'll just say, do not specify. In fact, no, I'll put squad rotation player, see what happens. There we go, Ruben Inza Bohiguez is in. That is a replacement for Jack Waghorn. That will probably be the end of player movement in this transfer window for our team. I know that you guys are hoping that it's not because transfer windows are goddamn exciting. But I have a strong team now. Maybe even pushing for top four in my first year. Who knows? Okay, so the press have predicted a finish of second for me in my first season. How crazy is that? 2-0 win against Hitafe in our last friendly match. Uh, Martin has picked up an injury out for seven days. We've got a training injury. Uh, Jack Atkinson's out for three, so it's not that bad. Crisis averted. Look at all these brilliant players who I can actually bring up to my team. Stefan Murphy is a no-brainer. He is so getting offered a contract. He's a centre-back as well. He can help out in that position. I will give him games. Jody cries you also. Very good player there. Off of the contract. Make it five years for 500 quid. Contract offer accepted by Stefan Murphy. We've also got a transfer offer for, for Stefan Betrovic. 15.5 million pounds is clearly not enough for Stefan Betrovic. You can sort off with that offer by Munich. Let's have a look at this Stephen Murphy guy. He's one of the most promising people to come out of our youth squad. He's 70 overall. 5'11", so he can play centre-back. I will allow him to play centre-back. Um, defensive work rate high and 3-star, three 3-star. Three so he's not bad. That's a good pull, actually. I will give Stephen Murphy enough time to grow into a good player. Hopefully we can see Stefan Murphy in the 80s before we finish this save. 
And Fleetwood Town are now a five star team. Transfer off four for Marcos Boboza. Manchester United want him. I'm not listening to any offers. So we shall finish this episode with the first game of the season. Fleetwood Town's first ever game in the Premier League. And it is against West Brom at home. There will be the Fleetwood Town Massive cheering our lads on. Making sure that we get the three points here in our shitty little stadium. I've got to be honest, this Fleetwood Town side is as good as the Chesterfield side who won the Champions League. Overall wise, they're about the same. Sousa Santos, welcome to the club, man. Well, this isn't about you, this is about Fleetwood Town as a club. This is their first ever game in the Premier League. What an occasion. Oh, big chance for West Brom already. Kachunga, great save, lad. Well played. Saved it with his back. For Scopo. Ah! Uh, uh, oh, nearly. Here he is. Good, courageous stuff to get in the line of the shot. Ben Basham. Long time no see, mate. Surely that was a foul. Ben Basham, you dirty bastard. Barbosa with the tackle. Nice. Nice. Solid defending from the Fleetwood Town side. Liking this defence already. Serge Mango free of defenders. Atkinson. Oh, yes. That was a fantastic finish there. Spectacular, acrobatic, and precise as well, just under the keeper's legs. And we take the lead in our first ever Premier League game. More of that, please. Nikwai Conde. Oh, too heavy that pass. Miguel's quick, but not that quick. To be honest, Ensue Lopez would have struggled to get that. Oh, nice. You've got to commend that defending. Souza Santos. Great debut for him so far. Solid at the back, along with Barbosa. Good pass. Oh, there is a big chance here. Souza Santos and Kachunga somehow manage to make sure that doesn't go into the back of the net. Well played, lads. Here's Serge Mango. This is at the other end. Mango tries to find Piscopo. I think he reached that as well. Wow. Nearly a second for Fleetwood Town there. And at half time, it's 1 0 to Fleetwood Town. Jack Atkinson with that acrobatic goal means it is 1 0 in Fleetwood Town's first ever Premier League game. But it is only half time. We must remember that. Petrovic sets off Miguel. Who's got enough speed? And found Petrovic! Oh, Stefan Petrovic! Oh, Stefan Petrovic! Oh, Stefan Petrovic! 2 0, Fluid Town. And how comfortable. Barbosa. Go on. Nice pass. He's done well. Both centre backs have done well. Uh, that cross regroup now. was the opposite kick. of doing well. Go on, go on, go on, Kachunga. We've, no we've got you all day long, mate. We are, we are marking like fucking legends. That's a good pass. Oh, heavy tackle, it's and again. He's, He's offside. Well, this defence has been excellent. Yeah, I mean, it was extremely close. It's so difficult for Linesman, but he got that one right. Well, all credit to the team. The attack was superb and the defence was even better. It finishes 2-0 to Fleetwood Town. This has been Cutter Gaming. Thank you very much for watching. Please like and subscribe and I will see you next time.